Cops and residents think a teenage crook is at it again. This teen Houdini, Colton Moore, has been on the run since he escaped three months ago from a group home on Camano Island. He had confessed to a string of burglaries. Now deputies think Moore is stealing again. And Como Ford's Akiko Fajita says neighbors are sick of it. Well, those living out here, many of them know Colton Moore personally, and they say they had a hunch that he was back after a string of burglars over the last few weeks. Last night, deputies spotted him in this parking lot as he jumped out of a moving car that crashed into this trash can. You just, you just kind of have an inkling that it is. That it is Colton Moore. Lori Flickner knew he was back when police called to say a stolen car ran into her Elger Bay grocery store. You just kind of wish that they would make some smarter choices, and um, I would rather they, they get a hold of him before something does happen. Island County deputies spotted Moore in a black sports car last night, speeding and driving erratically. When they tried to pull him over, he jumped out of the moving car. The officer picked a, a lit area, hope, hoping that he would pull over to the right. Instead of pulling to the right, he went to the left and then... And then into the Elger Bay, southwest corner of the Elger Bay grocery. A dumpster stopped the car from going into the store, but it didn't stop more. He ran off before police could catch him, launching an island-wide search. He pulled up to in front of my neighbor's house across the street, spotlighting some more, and then backed around the corner and sat up over there for a little bit. Tactical teams from Marysville expanded that search today with help from canine units. They combed through wooded areas down roads familiar to Moore without any luck. Just to do it over and over and over again and it's just a repeated slap in the face of the whole island. Josh Flickner says he's fed up with a 17 year old who's terrorized South Camano Island for years. In court last year, Moore admitted to breaking into homes, helping himself to beds, cars and credit cards. A judge sentenced him to three years in jail, but he ran away with more than two years left to serve. Deputies have been going all over the county handing out these flyers, letting people know that Colton Moore is back in the neighborhood. I just spoke with the sheriff's department. A uh, detective there tells me they have not found any good leads. In the meantime, that stolen car has been returned to the owner. Live on Camino Island, Akiko Fujita, Como Forney.